Hey guys, um, I have a little bit of a special video for you guys uh, today. I uh, like to title this video, you can see that I'm pretty pissed off about something. And, um, uh, throughout the video, I'm going to be probably like, really salty and, you know, just like really angry because, I, I mean, it's it's really annoying to me. I mean, I'm trying to, you know, just chill, um, but, um, it, it's hard when something like this happens and uh, a company favors certain people I should say um, but pretty much for all of you guys you know I'm not this because I'm gonna say this by the video I'm not hating on somebody I'm hating on a company um, but pretty much if you guys know anything about uh, the black ops 2 you know that if you cheat you get banned if you and if you like really cheat or you know, no cheating will result in a vac ban on steam of course and you will get permanently banned from the game um, but for all of you guys know, or actually another one, another thing, I just want to say, please, uh, there's, there's going to be so much hate, I know there's going to be so much hate, um, but before you even type anything in the comments or do anything like that crap, watch the whole video, watch the whole video please, because most of your questions probably will be answered, and if not, then you can go ahead and hate on me, I don't really care, um, but for all of you guys who know somebody, uh, his name is Phase Apex, uh, he got permanently banned from uh, Black Ops 2, and uh, right here, I'm going to put it up on the screen really quick, uh, he actually says that he got banned, um, and if I can find the message really quick, yeah, here it is, uh, right there, you see, uh, it says that he's been permanently banned, this is the same message I have, actually, so, uh, do I have, uh, let me get to it really quick, let me open up this for you, I'm gonna open up my Black Ops 2, it's probably gonna be a black screen really quick, cause I just have to add, uh, put the thing on. Uh, but I'll go to my Black Ops 2. It's going to be black screen, I know. Let me change it really quick. Right. If it wants to work. Alright, let me change it for you. Alright. So, game. Is game capture we're going to work? No? Oh, I have to turn this off, sorry. I forgot to do that. There we go. Um, so when I go to my Black Ops 2, and uh, I want to play online, I'm going to click on this. Uh, and it's going to do this. It's actually going to give me the same exact message. Um, it's it will actually, you know what? It gave me a message, uh, but it's weird because it only does it on zombies. Uh, it just does this forever. It never goes away for this. Um, but if you get this message, that means you're going to be banned. Uh, that's permanent ban, of course. Uh, if, but if I go to zombies, I don't actually have this installed anymore because it's stupid what they did. So I install, I uninstalled it. It's gonna message, and here it even says it. It's probably gonna be black screen again. I know. I'll um, change it off now. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to my Steam now, and I'm gonna go to my profile, and um, actually ah, 100 day. I have a game ban on my account. Uh, I another thing. Game ban is a huge difference from a vac ban. A game ban is not a vac ban. Uh, a vac ban is you are cheating. A game ban is something that a developer decides to do on you. And if I go to actually, if I go to Black Ops 2, and there's there's always that one guy in the comments who's always like, oh, I hate this game, I got banned for no reason. But when you actually go to the profile, it's a vac ban, which means you cheated. Uh, yeah, here we go. I don't, I'm banned. I don't hack. Like what? WTF. Uh, sorry, you need to attack. It's a vac ban. A vac ban is a valve to cheat, which means it detects cheating. Uh, a game ban is when a developer decides to put a ban on your account for whatever reason they feel is needed. Uh, and, you know, actually, right? It doesn't have to be. Che it, you don't have to be uh, cheating. Isn't that funny? Uh, yeah, I, 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 if I find the thing, I'll, I'll put it later on. But um, uh, a developer decides to put a ban on your account. They can do it if they feel a need to. Um, and then actually today. Uh, July 26 uh, phase apex uploaded this video called I'm I got unbanned uh, so he got banned and then all these people just because I'm not I'm not hating on phase apex all I'm saying is because he's so like, popular all these people sent it to him and he got uh, unbanned just because of the you know popularity that he got and it's annoying just because somebody's popular they can do um they have certain powers that uh, you know people like you know me have it says you should be unbanned you should be unbanned 
Um, that's not right. If you're permanently banned, I'm actually going to show you this in a second. It's, you cannot get unbanned. It says it. Um, and, you know, I guess just because he's, you know, so well known, um, he can, he can do whatever. I mean, this is, this is, uh, I'm going to sound like really hateful towards him, I'm not. Um, but for all, I mean, you don't, unless you actually know him, you actually know Faze, but you, like, you've known him for a very long time, you've, you know, you've always been friends with him, you know, kids in school and whatever not, um, then that's cool. But there's going to be people, oh yeah, I love him, so, you know, he, he never hacks. Why would he ever hack? I'm such a big fan of him. You don't know him. You're just a fan, just like me. Um, and that's, you know, one thing that where people, popular people, could hack and, you know, just, they could mm -hmm. hack. And uh, just because, you know, they said, um, you know, just because they post stuff like this, um, they can just get on band. Like, uh, I'm I'm not saying that he did hack, I'm not saying that he did not hack. But he said, oh, I haven't played in a week. For all we know, he played yesterday and used cheats. Um, but unless you, of course, know him, then we'll never know. Uh, so he can say whatever you want to hit, he get out. You can get out of it. And right here, if you actually go to Activision's customer support, uh, you do this thing, and you like you just go through, you know, like your system and your issue, and then you permanently ban. And it gives you the security enforcement policy. If you click on the security enforcement policy, uh, this is what it brings up. It brings up all these uh, issues that may have happened. Uh, you know, pirated content, modding, hacking, and blah blah blah, all this crap. And the first one for most of them is you'll be permanently banned from the game you play. So that's really, and still look at this, look at this. I just, I just realized this too. First offense, user will be permanently banned from playing the game while online. Stats and emblems reset and permanently blocked from peering the leaderboards. Now if I bring the other video back up, uh, guess what? He's, he's, he's got his stats. He has his stats. Um, which actually makes no sense, <laughs> um, of course. Unless he can say whatever he wants and get out of it, just because a lot of people did it. And, um, actually, here you go. And there's another article right here. Uh, this is temporarily permanent. It bans and hacking, cheating, and other behaviors, uh, violations of terms of, and terms of service are final. They are final and will not be discussed. Activision customer support will not be able to reverse any ban on your account. It's not reversible. It says it right there. It says it right there. It's, un it's unreversible. And I actually had a nice conversation with um, Activision support, and uh, yeah, they don't help. They don't help mm -hmm. at all. Um, hey there, unfortunately we're, we don't have any specifics or particular bans. All decisions are final and not up to review. They're not up to review. And uh, at Signature Policy, there's nothing we, there is nothing we can do regarding our banned accounts, so how come you can do it to his but not mine or anybody else's? You click on this, and they send me, and this is where you get it from. And it's it's really annoying. I mean, if you're seeing where I'm coming from, it's annoying. Now, so basically, I spent $30 when I completely came for something I never did. Uh, they never even respond to that. Uh, it's Yeah. Um, but it's, it's I'm probably sounding really salty right now. I know I am. I'm not hating on Face Apex. Like I just said, I'm not hating on him. I'm hating how Activision can just pick people who are well known and easily you know get them off that's not cool um it's annoying it's really really annoying how somebody well known can just get off and um you know it's it's it's, it's they, they can just do whatever they want with it because he's so well known i mean if, if let's say i switch places with phase apex i had my game man on. I just say, oh hey, change it up. They'll do it. Boom. It's that easy. If I was, if we switch places, and another reason is um, it says a hundred days ago. It's like, oh, well, why did you do it the first time? They wanted you to do it the first. It's like you've been banned for one day. Uh, it didn't show up for two weeks that I had a game ban. Uh, because I played Black Ops Two, then I went on vacation, and I never you know got back to play the game. And the we it actually didn't show up for fourteen days because I think we got back on the thirteenth, and the next day it said fourteen days. And by then, it was like, well, I have no reason to because, you know, there's nothing there. There's no examples out already. And also, it seems like it's too late because 14 days later. And until this recent news where somebody got unbanned from a permanent band, that brought me back. And um, I realized that I need to...
do something. I need to say something. How this is not right. How well known people get treated to you know a higher level than us. It's not cool. And if anybody has ever been banned and they haven't done it, a vac ban, I'm sorry, you're cheating. A game ban is a developer's problem. Um, and I even said, oh, well, what did I do? And they didn't even respond. So you're not even going to respond to me. You're just going to ban and get off. You know, they can just ban me, do whatever they want. And um, yeah, it's, it's really annoying. Um, uh, I'm just gonna end it right here before I get too angry. I'm already insanely pissed off right now. Um, but I'm probably gonna put somebody's uh, uh, Twitter in the uh, title. I'm gonna share it with a bunch of people. I'm probably gonna tweet it out to all, you know, probably face Apex, even though I doubt he'll uh, even look at the video or anything like that. And I doubt this video won't even get anywhere, um, because I'm not, you know, well known enough. But, um,. If it means anything, guys, please share it with people, even though I doubt anybody is actually going to do it, um, because I'm, you know, some people, I really hope, you know, some people do, and they will make a change, uh, but all I ask is that my band's removed from my account. Uh, thanks guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the video. Peace, everybody.